What's up guys, it's the Asian Werewolf back with another video and today video I'm gonna do a creepypasta on the TV show Pingu. And if you guys like these types of videos and want me to do more, let me know in the comments section because I really want to do more of these types of videos for you guys. So with that being said, um, follow me on my, um, my links. My links is gonna be actually you know what? Um subscribe to my channel, turn on the post notifications, comment, and give a big like on the video and you will and I will you know do more reason for you guys. Most people grew up with a happy little show called Pengu. Pengu was a show that had a clay penguin named Pengu. <clears throat> and it showed his adventures. The characters spoke some sort of penguin language. The original show ran from 1986 to 1998. There were apparently two unreleased episodes. That was later released a year later. Now this is where it starts to become curious. I was only like five or six when I saw the beginning of the Pengu episode called Pengu, called Pengu's Punishment. I saw a bit of it, but what I remember was Pengu was very angry and Mother began smashing plates. <clears throat> I also remember the episode with about Pengu playing outside <clears throat> when he was supposed to be doing chores. His mother, my mother came in at the plate smashing part, shut off the TV, and told me when and told me dinner was ready. I was looking. I was looking at the episode list on Wikipedia to find out that no episode called Pengu Punishment was released. I thought this is an adventure to myself, and I contacted Trick Film Studio, the company that made Pengu, and asked them about. And asked them for a complete production guide of Pengu. <coughs> they sent it to me via mail. I looked at it compared to Wikipedia's list, I noticed something went wrong about the file series. Pengu Helps Grandfather, which is the 23rd episode of Series 4. Series 4 was missing at the bottom, and the list was <clears throat> under... Uh, at the bottom of the list was the episode titled Pengu's Ending. I asked for a synopsis, but they refused to give me one, starting, stating it was personal information. I googled Pengu's ending on uh, I then I googled Pengu's ending re unreleased and Pengu's punishment. Then I found something that was a rapid share. The file was named Pengu Punishment Unreleased Last Episode dot zip. Then I downloaded it and went to my downloads and found the folder that contained two files. One that was a notepad file. One with a notepad file that was titled fear.txt. I opened it and read This is an unreleased episode of Pengu dated 1998. They originally planned to end the series and actually aired in some countries. Watch at your own risk. Ah. Uh. I opened it and read. This is an unreleased episode of Pengu dated in 1998. They originally planned to end the series and it was actually aired in some countries. Watch at your own risk. I begin to feel a bit suspicious 
and my heart pounded, but my curiosity overtook me, and I opened up the second file, file an A-V-I file. The first part was the same episode I saw when I was a kid. However, something felt off. The theme song was distorted, and instead of Pangu's usual newt newt, there was backwards audio. I recorded it with sound recorder and played it. You can't survive like this beyond death. I found that very creepy, but continued to watch the episode. I got I got to the part where Pangu's mother was smashing plates. Suddenly it cut to black. A blood curling scream was heard. It faded back to the kitchen. Pangu's mother was been was sitting on a stool crying. Only sound like real. She began crying and started to sound like laughing. Suddenly it cut to Pangu. Pangu was lying down on the floor. Her head was ripped off. I paused in there. I felt sick. But what made me even more sick? It wasn't clay blood. It was either it was either food coloring or it was real. I continued it. Pangu's mother began crying. Suddenly, it cut to black and white video. Two scientists going into a slaughterhouse. It showed a bunch of cows getting slaughtered. Suddenly, it start. It showed a penguin on a conveyor belt. The crushers crushed the penguin into pieces. It started showing pictures of dead penguins. It cut to Pangu's mother crying. A trembling was in the kitchen. There was also a fan. She jumped up to the fan and blood splattered everywhere. The body of Pangu's mother fell down. It and showed pictures of dead bodies of Pangu, Robbie, and other characters. And all music box played, Hush Little Baby faintly played. I popped the video and go to the bathroom to get sick. I felt really nauseous and sick after witnessing what I just watched. <clears throat> I continued the video. A distorted voice said something backwards. I recorded it and played it in reverse. It said, Your life will be pitch black in a few seconds. You must be you must be smart enough to play this backwards because you're stupid enough to believe me. My chest pounded and credit with a new with Times New Roman. The background continued to show a disturbing image. It it closed with a picture of a mask with red eyes. The mask only said in a distorted voice Darkness begins now. Suddenly my computer froze, then the lights flickered and the video went and the power went out. The power came back on a few seconds later. I was now shaking and I wanted to find the source of the film. I got in contact with Karo Banami, the voice actor for all the characters. I pretended like it was an interview and I talked about Pengu. I finally mentioned Pengu's punishment. He stopped and he asked where I heard that, where I had heard it before. I explained the entire thing to him and then he began to tell me the story. During the, during the 1998 season of Pengu, there's a writer and animator named Ted Goldman. Ted was a quiet man who usually wasn't that sociable. Sometimes during the middle of the season, Ted's mother began trying to read something from the upper shelf when the ceiling fan was still on. She got decapitated. Then Ted was immediately hurt by this. He began submitting morbid ideas such as Pengu killing all the other characters. He asked 
He even asked Minami to do the voice of Pengu dying. Goldman, Goldman found out that Pengu was, Pengu was closing production at the end of the season. Ted passed off the episode at the season finale. Right after, right, right after that, they had watched the episode. They discovered Ted was being charged with animal cruelty, bestiality, and murder. Ted left an apparent suicide note, claiming that he was going to move to our, to Antarctica. However, no records claim he was there. And he was last spotted in Santa Barbara, California, purchasing a gun. They never heard from him. I became shocked. Then, then a thought occurred to me to play the entire episode backwards, starting from the part before the distorted voice. I heard a scream, a shout, a very eerie voice that said something that still haunts me. And to this day, the only way out of this hill is suicide. Aftermath. The idea came out that I should po post it on YouTube to see what other people thought. And the file was still, the file was still on my computer, and I got about 200 or something views. There were only two comments. One saying, "Oh my God." So freaking creepy. I never thought paying I never watched him paying you again. And one said, I hope this is fake, but crap. That creeped me out. I was looking forward to my success. Suddenly I came back a few out to the video a few hours later. The video wasn't there. There was a message stating the video had been removed at a request by Ted Goldman. I immediately freaked out after this. And I became scared. A few minutes later, I got a virus onto my computer, even though antivirus was on. Which I found odd. My computer crashed, and I called a techie. The techie was able to back up all the files. After I got back on, I was looking around. Then I noticed something. The Pengu file was gone. I searched for it, but I was I wasn't able to find it. I asked Techie if he deleted anything, and he told me that he restored it, and nothing was deleted. As I was looking through my downloads, I found I found an odd TXT file I had never seen before. It's called Pengu.txt. I opened it. There was an ASCII of Penguin Mother dead and blew it. And below it, it said, The only way out of this hell is suicide. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed that episode. If you guys have, let me know in the comments below. And also, leave a big fat like on the video. And also, Subscribe to my channel, turn on the post notifications, you know, all that good stuff. Let's get the video to about 200 views and 200 likes. Well, well, 200 views. And if you guys like the video, you know, do all that stuff. And this has been the Asian Werewolf in Peace. I hope.